Acropora corals acros for short are a branching SPS type coral that are considered one of the most challenging to keep in captivity. However, with the correct level of care, patience, and dedication, hobbyists all over the world are successfully keeping these corals in their reef aquariums. Let's find out more about these gems of the reef hobby. SPS corals have hard calcium carbonate skeletons and small polyps. Under ideal conditions, they are quick growers. Acroporas are demanding. They require and crave stability over almost all else. They live in parts of the reef that have the highest light levels, the highest flow and surges, and need the most pristine water conditions. Under optimal conditions, they grow very quickly, and this in itself can cause problems down the road as the tops of the coral reach closer to the light and shade out the lower branches. The growth of Acropora colonies can also stifle water movement, which is also detrimental to the health of the coral. Hobbyists need to be able to accommodate and overcome these situations as they arrive in our glass boxes. Key takeaways here are stability. High flow never blast your corals with direct flow from a power head and very high lighting usually around for 100 plus par. Test, test, and test some more. Regular testing of alkalinity, calcium, magnesium, phosphate, nitrate, and salinity are a must. Always avoid major swings and parameters when dealing with Acropora. The sticks you see online and in your LFS today are for the most part. Aquaculture, which will make them more tolerable to minor swings and parameters and should be sought out and preferred over wild collected specimens as these will give you a higher rate of success. These corals are some of the most brightly colored specimens out of all of the different corals you can get for your aquarium and in the wild make up the backbone of the natural reef. So there you have it, this is the wonderful Acropora coral.